exciting it's going to be. And this is, this is kind of crazy because normally I have music and I really even hope that you can see me. I'm actually standing in my kitchen. Um, I am all about revolutionizing fitness for females and I'm all about no excuses. And you know, the thing that is, is we try to change our actions without changing our thought process. And oh, Nelly! <laughs> this is a teaching moment. Um, and what we have to understand is that our thoughts become our actions. Our actions become our past. And our past will dictate what we do. It's kind of like this vicious cycle. It almost becomes our future. If we have toxic patterns, um, those are going to be really hard to break. And then you develop what I call limiting set of beliefs, right? I believe this, but even though that may not be the truth. So there is a point to this whole rambling mess, is that for so long, exercise has been used in such a negative way for women to achieve various things. I mean, it could be something different for all of us. And we really forget truly what exercise was intended to do, which in my estimation, exercise is meant to give you a voice. And when I say give you a voice, it means to give you the self-confidence, the self-esteem, um, and the self-love to live a really full and vibrant life. I really think that's the only thing exercise was, was meant to do. And as long as we keep trying to force it to do something else, we're going to continue to battle it. And, um, you know, that, that word just keeps coming back, surrender. And it is so hard for us to do because, my gosh, we love control. And we want to control exercise to make it give us something, whether it's a smaller number on the scale, whether it's a certain image, a certain size, um, a certain status. I don't know. Um, whatever it has been for you. And so I want to show you that you don't need a gym, you don't need anything fancy. Um, all you need to do is change your mindset. You need to change your thoughts. That's it. Once you can change your thoughts, truly, the world is yours. And exercise is not going to be a struggle anymore and it's not going to be something you hate because you've now changed your value system. And it's going to be something that you desire. So, that being said, Here's a beginner metabolic workout. I know a lot of times you see my videos and they're crazy. Um, because to me, crazy is fun. And I've been doing this long enough. Um, but if you're just, you know, getting off the couch for the first time and you don't even know what it looks like or what a metabolic workout looks like, here you go. And there's all different things and different ways we can change this. For today's workout, all I'm going to use is a dish towel. That's it. A simple towel, okay? And my gym boss timer, which, okay, I'm not even gonna, you will soon find out I'm very opinionated. All loving and non judgmental, but very opinionated. Okay, we're gonna start by a dynamic reverse lunge. And I'm gonna slide, boom, I'm just like I'm running. Run, run, okay? So I'm gonna go 30 seconds on my right. That would be left, but you're right. Ready? Go. As fast as I can, because I want in 30 seconds to get my heart rate up high and get this leg burning, really burning. Not to mention I'm cleaning my floor. Much harder than it looks. Okay, my more advanced, we're going to go 
arm, you go up on your toes. Right? Maybe we go right here. Maybe we pull back and do little jumps. The key is to get breathless and burning and a high heart rate. Bicycles. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about the other leg. <laughs> 